Welcome. In this video, we're going to show you how to create a one-time volunteer event for your organization. A one-time event is a volunteer opportunity that will occur on a single day or one time over multiple consecutive days. Before we begin, make sure you're logged in. Please navigate to your organization's management page and create a new event. If you need a refresher on how to create an event, please watch our How to Create an Event video tutorial. To make an event a one-time volunteer opportunity, we first need to make the event type a volunteer opportunity in the leftmost dropdown. Next, we need to determine what kind of volunteer opportunity it will be. Click the dropdown to the right of the event type. For a one-time event, you can choose a single day or multi-day event. A multi-day event is a volunteer opportunity that spans multiple consecutive days. You can add time slots or shifts by selecting one of these options in the rightmost dropdown. For more information about shifts and time slots, please watch our Shifts and Time Slots Explained video tutorial. After you make these selections, proceed to fill in the relevant event information. You should then click the Wait, Save and Continue button in the bottom right hand corner. This will advance you through additional options including creating registration questions for your event. On the left hand sidebar, if you would like to learn more about registration questions, please watch our Creating Registration Questions video tutorial. Once you've finished creating your event, be sure to click the blue Publish button in the bottom right-hand corner to make your event visible. After we publish the event, we can go back to our event page and view how potential volunteers would see it. This event is a common example of what a one-day event will look like after it's been published. Another common type of one-day event is a multi-day opportunity with time slots. Here is a summary of the steps to create a one-time event. A written summary will also be available in the description of this video. If you're interested in watching any of these additional tutorials, Please click the title now. Thank you for watching this video. If you run into problems or have any difficulties, please don't hesitate to reach out and contact us.